smooth let's go back to it okay we have it in here let's open it with the text editor in here we can see the controls we can see the button and the previous text that were in the English section English localization to do this we'll try to change it to German I'm sorry if uh, I don't write uh, the correct uh, things here but it's the Google translator that helped me do this so we'll just have a Zihern yeah we'll have a Brechen and the <laughs> big one the item Oh, sorry, <laughs> this was before. Posten erfolgreich. Gespeichert. Probably is not correct, but this is one hard proposition for me to say. We just save it. We have it in here. Now we must go back and create a new folder. We just name it uh, here for, from Deutschland, the German culture. And we'll go back here and create the resource file for it using the same tool. This is hard to to write it, and probably I'll miss something we'll have a generate we'll have a translate csv file and the output should be in level up the culture should be deutsch and the file oops of course I forgot something I forgot here to put this okay no error this is good I told you I would forget something but here we go again and we have the localization resource file we managed to complete things but the result if we run it run it is still in English to see the change we could go to control panel and for regional settings change the lo global lo culture to German or we can do this programmatically in code which we will do right now we'll just open the application here and I will uh, override the on startup to set the thread culture hmm. This was fast, wasn't it? I just copied from a snippet. So we have uh, basically now uh, English US culture. We'll just run it. Ta da! Of course, nothing has changed. We have save, cancel, let and say successfully. We'll just comment this and run it again. <laughs> I really hope I'll see a German. All right, we got Zihern, Abrehen, und very complicated to say okay so basically this is how it can be done of course in a real uh, in a work time application uh, the user will change his pro this preference from a uh, Manual or from some form somewhere and uh, he'll have the application in whatever language he desires In uh, big lines, this is what I wanted to Discuss today. It was uh, very interesting 
at least from my point of view, uh, it is complicated to achieve this. It is. I'm sure that uh, there are some other ways to do it. I read about uh, another another couple of ways, but uh, this one I enjoyed most. And uh, in the future, we'll see how this will develop. From now on, we'll start with a little more uh, complex tutorials. Feel free to comment here on YouTube uh, or on uh, my blog. Feel free to recommend tutorials and I'll try my best to do them for you. Thank you very much all for wa watching. Please write code with as uh, few mistakes as uh, possible. Uh, by the way, I, I remember something I read in a book, just an amusement thing. They say that uh, the programmer is the worst person in the world who could test its application. Because, of course, uh, you don't want to find your mistakes in your program, of course. Well, uh, somebody said that this is wrong. The worst person that can be forced to put it to test a programmer's application is his mother. <laughs> because no mother would like to say something bad about his her child. <laughs> Got it? So, until then, just find somebody else to test your application for you. And uh, that's all we'll have all great, great satisfactions.